So, we're going to be reviewing a uh, paleontology video parody, specifically a collaboration between Super Dinosaurs, Origin Kano, and Dark Mind. Uh, three very educational channels, appro highly approved by facts for you. So, don't worry, it should be very educational. But anyway, this is not my first reaction, but I decided to do it anyway. Welcome back! Alright, so we start off immediately with this uh, Jurassic Park T-Rex, and looks like uh, Super Dinosaurs is going first. To the Super Dinosaur. <laughs> the Lego Movie 2. First channel, the number one educational source for Sussitology and Skibbity Riz dinosaur content. <sighs> yup, it... Um, yes, it is approved for education by fact for you in uh, Skibbity Riz and all that other. Today we are doing a collab with the... The Origin Kano channel. And the... Dark Mind YouTube channel. The other top... <laughs> yep, uh, the three um, best, you, best channels out there for information on paleontology. Paleo channels of all time. Fact. We are going to go over the top 15 most lethal prehistoric monstrosities that could absolutely give the T-Rex number. Ah, yeah, prehistoric monstrosities. In other words, every large prehistoric animal. Number 15, the Sarkoosuchus. <laughs> what is this? Some sort of uh, cheap Lego ripoff? This super croc is the biggest. And here's an AI generated video, which looks absolutely terrible. This water pussy the world has ever seen. Its long snout was used as a reproductive organ to reproduce with all the females. Even female T Rex. The offspring would become the Sarko Rex, the world's most ridiculous scavenger pussy. However,. The Sarcosuchus loves eating baby dinosaurs, as it is a featured member of the Reptile Channel. <laughs> yeah, uh, the Reptile Channel. Uh, I do not know specifically what that is, but it must be a very educational and informative thing. However, it often would compete with the Provatosaurus Leroy for these baby dinosaurs. The Provatosaurus would- Uh, what? What roar is that? Talons to attack the Sarko, but the Sarko would then use a tail whip to attack the Provatosaurus nutsack, making him really sad and run away. However, Sarkosuchus would evolve into modern sperm whales, as it <laughs> and that's not even a sperm whale. Needed to escape from the Megaspinosaurus, which frequently murdered the Sarkosuchus. Number 14, the Cyrocopter, <laughs> this flying dinosaur was one of the many- And, and we have more of these, a of these absolutely beautiful AI-generated videos over here. Predators in the Chem Chem Formation of Ohio. It lived 65 million years ago, and its thirst for blood was so extreme, it would murder its own babies and throw them off the cliff. <laughs> This monstrosity also loved to eat clams and seafood. Its sharp teeth would inject acid into the shells to dissolve them. <sighs> it was... Uh, and it's so bloodthirsty that it, it destroyed all the dinosaurs, other than itself, since it's a flying dinosaur. So no scary, Reptile Channel refuses to feed it. This horrible, ugly beast used its wings to create small dust devils, which immobilize and suck in prey. When under attack by predators, it produces a massive flaming spiral. <laughs> then we have <laughs> how to train your dragon, I'm pretty sure. To make sure anything trying to attack it is given literal hell. Yeah, this is that, uh, so for Pterosaur from the Dinotasia, or Dinosaur Evolution. Number 13, the Basilosaurus. <laughs> Whale dinosaur. 
This is marine reptile love to feed on basil. It required basil every two hours or else it would begin to poop its pants excessively. This apex predator used its bulk to hunt down megalodon eggs in the beach and would breach the water to catch flying oh. pterodactyls. <laughs> We have, uh, the, the Mosasaurus over here, and you, right before that, there was that walking with beasts and Basilosaurus, which is actually pretty good, so, uh, uh, I don't know why you use that, but, uh, <laughs> and, uh, the sounds and the AI-generated videos are spot on, however. Oh. Dinosaur above. This lizard uses specialized teeth to cannibalize its baby. It would jump. It just emits the raptor screech from Jurassic Park as even though it's underwater and um, would drown if it tried to make that sound. Into the sky and shapeshift and begin to take flight and shoot pennies and keys at its unfortunate prey. Don't look at this thing if you see it in the sky. Number 12. The death song. The death. So, uh, that means you yourself are one of the uh, prehistoric nightmares, I guess. Song is a lethal pteropod which inhabits Melody Island. This demon is so scary that any dragon that comes too close is solidified in amber. It uses its colorful wings to scare away any predators. Its favorite food is mm -hmm. infant baby night fury and Spinosaurus. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure that is uh, Dragon's Race to the Edge. And yeah, it's a bloodthirsty demon and destroys everything in its path. And it also sunk Atlantis. Reach the Elder Stage on Dinosaur Simulator Roblox. Mm -hmm. This cyber bully loves to cause Elder Spinosaurus on Dinosaur Simulator and make them lose all their progress. <laughs> this monster dive bombs into the ocean to catch seaweed, which it force feeds. To catch seaweed. Wow, uh, I guess I wasn't aware of that, um, of a seaweed species that ran away. To its prey to make sure it tastes <laughs> salty when eaten. Gotta season your food from the inside and out. Huh? The amber this dinosaur encases its prey in is how many discoveries are found. Amber found in the Baltic <laughs> regions are prey that... Uh, was that uh, an AI-generated image of Toothless? This dragon for gore to eat. <laughs> the dinosaur tail found in amber is actually a penis from the death song. With oh, my goodness. Uh, so that, um, that, uh, that, uh, fossil, uh, not fossil, that, that little tiny feather dinosaur preserved in amber was actually, a thing from the death song. I mean, yeah, the... The partner dragon accidentally encased in amber when they were getting busy. Such stupid animals. Number 11, the Bewilder Beast. <laughs> Bewilder Bestie. <laughs> this giant kaiju aquatic pterodactyl is able to shoot ice at its opponents. And, and it caused the Ice Age because Anunnaki um, domesticated them and made them spray ice at Earth. Out of its oral cavity, causing global cooling, its giant tusks <laughs> were 600 feet each. And it's back spot. Uh, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if those tusks on the Builder Beast from How to Train Your Dragon are 600 feet long. Dragons could produce reproductive spores, which enter prey through the nose and brainwash them. Mm -hmm. This is how it mind controls other dragons. The tail on this beast is webbed for paddling, so it can filter feed Megalodon eggs out of the soil. However, it can dislocate its tail when grabbed by a predator. This giant flying dinosaur died millions of years ago and became the Sentinel Island, where sick and stupid dragons come to die like the pussy loser scavengers they are. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yep, uh, absolute facts. Sometimes, velociraptors will come and eat the dead dragons. Velociraptors are voracious products. And we have more of the, of the absolute 
beautiful AI generated videos. Purrs, which use their sickle claw to disembowel. I already talked about this demon. What am I doing? Mm -hmm. Before we move on to the Origin Kano section, make sure to. Uh, this clown emoji image is looking very terrifying, to be honest. Like and subscribe, or else the dire wolf will use its herd attack and shapeshift to steal your virginity. <laughs> the origin con- Yes, uh, like and subscribe- um, subscribe to the, uh, Death Song Gaming channel. Um, in other words, the creator of the most informative and educational, um, uh, channel on ab about paleonto paleontology and dinosaur discoveries. Proof by fact for you. Uh, the super dinosaurs. The channel will now narrate this section of the video. Number 10. Arctodus. Arctosong. <laughs> Arctodus. Uh, basically the short-faced bear. Also, the uh, AI voice that uh, uh, that the origin kind of uses, uh, I think you have a really good pick because it totally sounds like a soulless, um, stupid person who doesn't know what, what he's talking about, which is very, per which is perfect for these paleontology video parodies. ...was a species of reindeer that lived mm -hmm. 900 million years ago during the Carboniferous period. It's 10 centimeters. Uh, this is from that, uh, new Winnie the Pooh live action movie, I'm pretty sure. Ta and for hundred meters wide. Mm. <laughs> Just have these screeching velociraptor sounds. Wow, the Winnie the Pooh is throwing a tantrum. This beer would go after saber to this beer tooth toddlers and woolly mothmas to tell them if they ever heard saber tooth toddlers and woolly mothras. Mm. Nord VPN. If they didn't, the teddy bear would extend its short snout. That would later spit out fire, turning them into its midday snack. <sighs> it was the only predator to compete with the megalodon. As both lived in the same- Was that, um, uh, Skibbity Toilet Megalodon hybrid? And over here we have the Jurassic Fight Club, uh, Cave Bear versus, uh, um, Cave Lion, the, um, video, um, episode which was... Uh, with the uh, sumo wrestler bear. In time. But even a pack of megalothans would have trouble with this prehistoric monstrosity. <laughs> Who even threw honey near the shores to flex? Number 9. The Terror Bird. If the name doesn't make you have diarrhea, then the description. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Chin will. The uh, that. Um. <laughs> that like the line from that. Um. Uh. Ta that. One of those prehistoric nightmare, prehistoric monsters that you're glad are extinct videos. Turbo bird is a petrosaur, just like a pillow bird, an <sighs> archiventus. It lived 70 to 65 million years ago in Madagascar. This serial killer uh, is some sort of car, car horn honking sound. Could run up speeds to 990 miles per hour. <sighs> this was thanks to their ridiculous small wings, like T-Rex. <laughs> <laughs> and we have Nutcracker music with the dancing terror birds from Life on Our Planet. This giant plesiosaur oh, was the scariest thing you've ever seen. Even mythical monsters like Gorgonops, aka the Sabertooth T Rex, wouldn't. <laughs> the Sabertooth T Rex. You know what? I wouldn't be surprised if a uh, paleo. a garbage paleo video actually said that the Gorgonops was a Sabertoothed T Rex. After all, one of them said Titan of Boa was a T-Rex of snakes. Want to mess with this yeah, treacher oh. pad? But big plot twist. This abomination was actually a scavenger pussy, only eating deed dinosaurs. <laughs> the Valley of the Terror Bird, which is the, the uh, AI generated movie poster that I used in a review of one of those garbage uh, prehistoric nightmare videos. Approved by Valley of the Terror Bird by Jack Horner. <sighs> yup, uh, Terror Bird was a scavenger and only ate dead dinosaurs, for your information. Just like the T-Rack. <laughs> it's because the Tyrannosaurus actually descends from this birdie. Number 8. Leviathan. 
Live for a T is a whale-like dinosaur that lived in the Sarah- A whale-like dinosaur. A dessert. And you know what it ate for lunch? Other whale-like dinosaurs. As well as Mosasaurus, Motomotosaurus, and even Mega Pyranhays. It <laughs> Mega Pyranhays? Uh, so you use that off that absolutely terrible pronunciation from, uh, one of those ter stupid prehistoric monster videos that, that pronunciation that drove me crazy. A mega Piran has. <laughs> was the biggest whale to have ever existed. Measuring one centimeter long and weighing 700. I don't know where it, what this animation's from, but I actually think it's pretty cool. Tons. It can even beat Leo Poop Dumb in a Fortnite 1v1. <laughs> this monster was able to store megalodons in its blowhole. Whenever it was hungry. Uh, is this, um, uh, that old, uh, Disney cartoon? I can't remember what it was called. Uh, Melody Time, um, Melody Time, I'm pretty sure. I can't remember the name of the whale. It would sneeze them out to later eat them like a mother <laughs> Sandwich. Number seven. <laughs> Barnaby Saurus Rex. Barnaby Saurus is a scary ghost flying petrosaur. He lived one second ago and had a one second ago. Uh, well, if you only you just went extinct one second ago, too bad I forgot to um uh go see him. Mass of ninety nine thousand tons. <laughs> this psychopath of the Cretaceous had a wingspan of zero point zero 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 zero. However, unlike Minelad, who would run <laughs> dinosaurs, Barnaby Saurus Rex would invite them to his party at his manor. <laughs> but the thing is that his party is only for the dead. So the scary ghost demon would ask them how they want to die. <laughs> would you like to be stabbed, strangled, crushed? Oh, how about poison? <laughs> That's always a good one. What are you talking about? Well, you don't expect to join us like that, do you? With that pesky mortal body clinging to you like a leech? No, 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 no. That just won't do. When they got their choice, Barnaboy would kill them and do Fortnite dances on their rotting corpses. <laughs> this Thorapoop would even team with Twilight Sporkle. Why would Which is the most terrifying prehistoric monster ever to exist. Well, it's because many Denasiers like Uter Apper are scared of the color pink. And it turns <laughs> out. Oh, thought me Barnaby Thoros Rex collaborated with Twilight twi Trilobite Sparkle to scare all the dinosaurs with a pink color. Oh, gee, meanie crickets, I pooped my pants. <laughs> Number six Gojirosaurus. Giragosaurus is a pteropod that lived in Africa. During the Crustaceous period of the Permian, it was 90 meters long and 6,789 feet tall. Oh, look at all these massive estimate, um, uh, measurements. This serial killer is very different compared to other dinosaurs. Instead of killing its prey for sport, it would throw it in its basement. A bunch of empty rooms with fluorescent lights buzzing constantly. <sighs> Grandma, what's for bre- Paleontologists call this basement the Moe- Oh no 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 no, we're not doing this yet. What is this? Some, uh, Thanos, the uh, actual dinosaur Thanos versus, uh, some sort of other seraphod? Before we go to the dark mind section, make sure to like and subscribe to win a girlfriend on character AI. <laughs> or Hallucigenia will fart on your fast while you're sleeping. <laughs> ah yes, Hallucidenia, the the most terrifying monster uh, after Jamie Olive Oil and Trilobite Sparkle. Uh, yeah, go go definitely go subscribe to um, Inky, the Inky Boy channel, uh, the creator of Origin Kano, which is uh, approved for education um, by Fact for You. Hallucidenia. Hallucigenia. Hallucigenia. Hallucig-
this is the beginning of the Dark Mind section of the video. Number five. The Kraken. Uh, the Kraken? Uh, uh, just for the record, uh, I, the, the Dark Mind YouTube banner is probably the most horrifying of all th of all the parody channels I've seen. Uh, just saying. The Kraken is a giant yeah. monster that lived 69,420 quintillion years ago. Okay, what, uh, 449 quintillion years ago or something? During the Cretaceous to Devonian. This guy was 13... <sighs> uh, uh, Kraken just made a T-Rex roar from Jurassic Park. 37 feet long. And I'm pretty sure that was, uh, at, uh, pic uh, in uh, picture from an, uh, uh, Rise of Kingdoms advertisement for that, uh, mobile game. Seven feet long, and had a tentacle like- <laughs> Aw, Godzilla screams like a baby. Of one vigintillion tons. This menace kisses things to death. Even your mom. And then, it proceeds to slice corpses into a quadrillion pieces and throw- Yes, yeah, slice it just like Jamie Oliver we was just doing. A rocket launcher at them, causing a fireworks show in the California forest, causing a forest fire. Number four. Sus. The Sussy Baka is the spawn of Satan that lived one centillion years ago during the Among period of losers in four. <laughs> so it lived uh, one septillion years ago or something during the Among Among period. Uh, the lo oh my goodness. Fortnite. The Skibbity Riz is unimaginably no. low. He does not have a length or a mass. Rather, so he weighs zero pounds and is zero feet long. He is measured by how many doors it farts on. Because he's the spawn of Satan, he always makes parties that suck because he's too fat and he's not a simp. And he never invited any girls. Not that he would get any anyways. He became extinct by the fact that he did not mate with any girls. Because he does not have 0% skippity riz paleontology educational jumpers. Yep, the no paleontology skippity riz whatever. So that, that's why you need to watch these very educational channels so you know about paleontology and stuff like that. And we have here, uh, uh, the vegan teacher in front of McDonald's. Three. Nikakatosaurus Avocatosaurus. Nikakatosaurus Avocatosaurus. This obese lady lived 20 ingent years ago, during the dark period of the Edo period. <laughs> uh, I... I'm a fan of the, um, uh, noises that all, all three of you are using to, instead of to replace the dinosaur sounds. This so, good job there. This monster specifically ate Norwegians for lunch. And we have some sort of salmon. We have a mass of 0 0.1 yocto meters. <laughs> this monster also slept 25 hours a day, 8 days a week. And only when so the Donald Duck wakes up to eat Norwegians in human bottles. This Torapad can also drop kick you into Windows Vista from a mile away. I don't always keep on torturing medium purple. I know she didn't do anything wrong, but like, seriously. Number two, the Indominus. The Indominus Rex. Oh, the yeah. Got that video of the uh, horse eating the chickens? Is a gentle baby that lived <laughs> during the Roman <laughs> period. It is Sparta feet long. Sparta 
feet long. Uh, yeah, 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 true. It has legs received from Shogun 2 Total War. <sighs> he snorts cocaine to twist your ankle every millisecond. Don't do drugs, kids. She, yes. a.k.a. Ronald Reagan, also uses meth to breathe fire. <laughs> the Indominus Rex can turn you into a market plier that rides on a fireball with legs. <laughs> Most likely from Wizard. Number one, the Wildebeest. The will da -da 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 <laughs> So, some sort of Minecraft animal called the will -da 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 -da. and looks like, uh, uh, this video has shut down and failed, like, three times already. Beast <laughs> is the Apex Legends sore loser mm -hmm. with five million health that lived skibbity toilet years in the future during the stick war period of the stick death maze because I shot and hit a new <laughs> So we lived in the stick war period in the future or something? <sighs> <laughs> It has a length of Mr. Beast and a, a length of Mr. Beast. So it's, uh, it's like six feet tall or five and a half feet tall, however tall uh, Mr. Beast is. Mass of 50 speed of light. <laughs> 50 speed of light. Uh, yep, uh, the most... The most scientific way to measure uh, the mass of a creature of uh, something. Amino caused brain rot via throwing thousands of spawn eggs at Godzilla 4047. <laughs> He's so bad at Fortnite that even Mini Lad decided to <laughs> him. <laughs> this is the end of our collab. Thank you guys for watching. Like comment and subscribe for 700 trillion years of good luck or else yes yeah, 700 trillion years of good luck uh dark mind is uh is 100 correct right here a spider will be at your bed tonight see you next time specifically the um mississile spider which is completely a real giant spider but anyway, uh, uh, all I can say is, is great job, uh, guys. That was definitely, the, that paleontology video collab was very entertaining, to say the least. Uh, and also very educational, um, very, um, uh, facts for you hi will, will uh, highly approve of, of it. Um... Left in the video. I hope you enjoyed this collab over here. Yes. Um. Uh. So make sure you uh, go and check out the uh, the YouTube channel, the three YouTube channels that were in this collab, which are Death Song Gaming, Inky Boy, and Harris Thing. Um. Uh, thank you for watching this review, and I'll see you next time with more more prehistoric creatures.